Waking up over him texting a girl while we were exclusive and stalking other girls. This is the breaking breaking up over him texting. Oh yeah, he brought that stuff. Bro, why you put this? Alright, this response. Yeah, this that's it's crazy, bro. Um. I just feel like it should have just been an like, easy problem to fix. Like, no way. What, um. Brecky Hill dropped TikTok clowing Jinxie after he went live and explained the breakup. Say it back, bro. Let me, let me make some views off this. Oh, hell no, nah, bro. Nigga, you say, all right, bro. Let me cook up real quick. I just wanted to come on here um, because it's something that's been on my mind for a while and something I want to get off my chest before I take a little bit of a break from the internet. I have decided to stop OnlyFans. Um, oh, it's shit. something that I definitely should have stopped the second I got into a relationship. Also, knowing that that relationship was public, um, that's something I won't forgive myself for. Bro, it's like, I, don't, I don't know what it's like. It's like some new updates and shit. Bro, no comment, bro. No comment. OnlyFans is something that has taken a really big toll on my mental health. And I do think a lot of the problems in our relationship were caused by that. Um, when I moved to LA, I kind of just fell down this hole and didn't even realize what I was doing. And it's just, it didn't reflect me as a person at all. Um, and again, that's not something I will be able to forgive myself for. But, but I do think I can focus mm. on making better decisions. Pretty much every creator on that site um, has an agency that runs the account for them or helps them. Are you the exposing account. the account? Oh, so shit. things that were being posted and being sent out like really affects me. Nick, the person I. It's like, bro, whatever he was trying to do, the shit just backfired because. Now the other person is cooking your shit. Like, what do you? Hold on. Like, I feel like, bro, I'm not, I'm not an expert. I'm, bro, this don't have the best advice, but it's like, bro, this shit comes off as gossiping, cause like, nigga, your ass got online and filmed a one minute video. Like, you could have just went to the person and talked about the problem. Like, nigga, like, bro, come on, man. And then the other person upload the video. And he, I ain't gonna lie, that person probably cooking your shit. I ain't gonna lie, bro. Hold on, bro. This what it this what it was about. Not gonna lie, they all got this. This some this some wild shit, man. Oh, okay. I was with, um, I loved him Why more than I knew I could love someone. He is such an amazing person. And, um, I think towards the end of our relationship, we both did things to each other that made each other hurt. And we, um, at the end of the day, just want to see each other happy. So I will be doing nothing but cheering him on from the side. And I will always. Yo, what the fuck are you wearing that for, bro? Because Gwen's my favorite snow bunny. Thanks for the hearts. I know I have a love for Gwen because she's my favorite snow bunny. Thank you, bro. Yo, is this is this what you got to... Thank you, man. Thank you. Hearts, roses, you roses, roses for Gwen. Bro, bro why yo, you pushing me, bro? <laughs> hey, pressing it right. He just spamming. Bro, what the fuck?